talking about movies and talking about stuff that I enjoyed, have you guys seen this? Sisu. I watched this over the weekend and I'm going to categorically say out here, hot take. Sisu is a better movie than John Wick 4, chapter 4. Sisu, the movie that just came out, is a better movie than John Wick 4. I don't care what anyone says. In terms of action, it's the best. And the guy in it rarely speaks. If I'm not mistaken, um, it's based in Finland. So it's a Finnish movie with, with, with subtitles, of course. And essentially, it talks about the... Um, it's based on the Second World War, the end of the Second World War. So just as the um, the Nazis are basically, you know, um, they're basically accepting defeat and they're all basically gathering their resources, getting the last of the remaining, you know, loot that they can get from neighboring towns and kind of going back home, quote unquote, to face the music. They kind of cross paths with a... Um, with a former general of the Finnish army who just lives in isolation by himself, right? And he essentially lives by himself in some random place where he's digging for gold. And he essentially is trying to find that gold in terms of the way to kind of get him back out from, you know, depths of poverty and kind of try and rescue the owner of his family, blah, blah, blah. But he's only, he's there by himself. So this army crosses parts of him and it basically charts the entire story of them essentially taking the gold from him, obviously by beating him up and him essentially enacting revenge and killing everybody, essentially. <laughs> that's basically what it's about and i swear to god it is so fucking good and from what i understand it was filmed on a shoestring budget i think if i'm not mistaken something like 10 million or something stupid like that in terms of effects in terms of the fighting was really good supposedly the lead actor is in his like 60s you'd never guess it he's incredibly incredibly you know really he's really good at fucking you know acting in terms of you know fighting and shit combat he barely says any words if i'm not mistaken the first words he actually says out of his mouth are right at the end of the movie everything is done in like grunts and groans and long pauses and really amazing shots and stuff like honestly the acting in this movie is so good especially from the supporting cast because the main lead guy doesn't act he doesn't say anything he just acts with violence and shit but it is so fucking good really really good i really really enjoyed it just because it didn't try and tell this like nonsensical story that had to include diversity and shit there wasn't some random black dude just popped up with dreads <laughs> who happened to be a soldier in the, in the third reich or something it was just a really fun time in terms of a movie and i really fucking enjoyed it um short length as well if i'm not mistaken it was like 90 minutes runtime or something like that really easy to watch no not didn't take yourself too seriously and in my opinion, a far better movie than John Wick Chapter 4, which I watched eventually. And again, maybe it's laptop. It's a laptop movie era that I'm in at the moment where the majority of my movies I'm watching are on my laptops and whatnot. So it's not probably the best. I'm not the best judge for these type of things. But I do think, to be fair, that a lot of these movies, they don't pass a laptop test. Like, it took me a while to get through John Wick Chapter 4. It took me a strong while. It took me like a good couple of days. I broke it up in like 20 minute increments and I could get bored, get using my phone, opening different tabs and shit. And then I eventually finished it. Don't get me wrong, but it wasn't as um, exhilarating or it didn't keep me on the edge of my seat or hold my attention like the other chapters did. And I felt like just in general, the stories kind of played out. Um, it didn't really, you know, spark my, you know, interest in, in that regard. But, sisu definitely did and i really recommend you check it out the premise behind it was good just how it's kind of played out the fact that he doesn't talk that much and it's the story is just told with these other people around supporting characters characters kind of adding you know um adding kind of a color to the story and filling it out and stuff and it's a perfect length and it worked really 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 well and minimal cgi as well from what i can tell some special effects of course but minimal and it does really really well to be fair so definitely check it out if you haven't already it's called sisu it's finnish um i think sisu the whole term around it, it's a finnish word for like never giving up it's kind of a finnish word for kind of you know being a dog and never accepting death and shit and honestly this guy is amazing so if you haven't checked that out then i do recommend you check out that movie 